Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today we are be going to, I'll be explaining what my possible team will be in Pokemon Sword and Shield. And remember guys, a disclaimer, do not be going in Sword and Shield after watching this video or the prior one expecting any of these Pokemon to be in there. They might not be at all. These are just Pokemon. If I see them, I will grab them. And, you know, I have Rhyperior. I elaborated that on my last video, but I like it because it's bulky. Denene, because my friend. Go watch my other, uh, with my puzzle Pokemon team first part. My Pokemon Sword and Shield team in the first video. I will be, uh, in the playlist. Heck, I'll even put it in the description for you guys below. Save you the effort and time and breath. But, you know, it's a friend. I like it. So, let's go go watch his video on why. Or my video, why. Our video, whatever. And for Fru, remember why, because I'm going to be the XY champion. For more elaborated, go check out the last video I'll, that I'll still put in the description. And when we get to the new Pokemon, I've added a couple Pokemon since last Monday. There should be videos coming up on every Monday till we hit the sixth part. And a new Pokemon that's been added that if I see, or if I see its prior evolution, Vulpix, I will probably catch and add it to my team. And that Pokemon is... Dun -dun -dun -dun, Nine Tails. Well, you already know what it is, but the reason I want Nine Tails on my team because it's just an elegant and beautiful Pokemon. And this fan art down here, I like it a lot. I think it's beautiful Nine Tails. It's beautiful Pokemon, and its shiny is pretty cool too. It's like a mystical rare shiny. I, there is no mystical rare shiny, but to me, it's like a mystical rare because it's something about that silver. I know it already has red eyes in its prior non-shiny form, but just that sh silver and blue on the end, it looks good. And, you know, the Alolan one is good too, but I think I prefer the fire one than the Alolan ice and fairy. I think because I just want to just, I think it looks cool. And that, that fan art really gets my attention. It looks so cool. Are, oh, sorry, guys. And the stats are pretty good. I mean, they get to 505. 100 speeds, 100 defense. And these aren't, like, too bad. Special attack being 81, defense being 75, attack being 76, and HP being 73. I think it's pretty good. So that's my thoughts on it. Not really too much of a family special. Nothing too much of a friend using it. I, I just want to use it. I never really used them before in a game, but... Just because uh, it kind of looks cool and... Mainly because it looks cool, and I think it's a beautiful and elegant Pokemon. Now, Mudsdale. This Pokemon, actually, I do have a special connection with. It was, I would say, my ace Pokemon in my Sun and Moon walkthrough on my Sun Let's Play. Uh, I got it as a Mudbray, it all into a Mudsdale, and I liked it. I really enjoyed using it. It's probably one of my favorite Pokemon. I mean, when I think favorite Pokemon, I probably wouldn't think of this right off the bat. You know, Rapierior, Denene. Well, sorry, not so much that. Pokemon, but... And it's shiny. I think it's a nice change, but not too much of a big, weird green. I think it's a nice change with a caramel and blue mane. And the fan art looks good. And the stats aren't bad either. I mean, the speed ain't too bad. Even though it's a horse, so that's a little weird. Special attack ain't too bad, but I'm not surprised. I don't see it shooting fire or bomb balls or whatever. It's HP and... Attack defense is pretty good, and its special attack is good. Yeah, well, actually, no, it's not too good. But it kind of, because its special defense, well, because its special attack is kind of low, and you, well, I mean, I, hang on, sorry. If its special defense were lower, it, w I, it would be kind of bad to use against water-type Pokemon, because I feel like most water-type moves are special attack, like Surf, and Hydro Pump, and Bubble Beam, and Bubble, and Water Gun. And brine. A waterfall. That's physical, I believe, because like, like whooshes at them to a waterfall and body slams them. And then we have Dof D uh Dopon. I don't actually know pronounce his name. Sorry. Dofon. D O P A wait. Sorry guys. D O M P A H N Dompon. Sorry, I don't want to pronounce his name. I should. But I like this Pokemon because again, it looks cool to me, and you know that I like bulky looking ground type Pokemon. And I think it's the fan art looks cool. It's a cool elephant rhino. Its stats, or its shiny looks good to me. I like that, like gold, bronze, burnt brown armor with that green. 
I like it. And then we have the HP, which is pretty good. Uh, attack and defense is pretty good. Special attack, special defense, eh. Especially with, uh, like I said, with Mudsdale, if it was special defense was lower, it would kind of be bad. But with special defense base being 60, it could be a little bad going against uh, special attack water users. And its speed, that's just expected to come with bulky Pokemon, specifically ground type. But its defense makes up for it. And even gets to 112 and 240 at min and max. 112 min, 240 max for special defense and special attack. So it's not like the worst thing. But you can definitely bring it up with some Carbos or whatever it is. So I think, again, I think I just like it because it's cool. It's got horns. It's got rhino, bull, elephant thing. The cool light green and a gold bark, like a burnt chocolate, light chocolate, burnt brown caramel thing. It looks, it looks cool. And its trunk also like rolls, and I think it's supposed to be like a whirly pearly too, which I, I just, I, I really like this Pokemon's design. I think it really looks cool. And then we have Kingdra. Quite a few people I would feel like Kingdra. It's a cool Pokemon, a dragon in water. I mean, what's not to like about it? It has an elegant design. It has a nice shiny, or shiny is a nice, cool purple. It's HP and speed. It's good. It's good. But it's attack, defense, special back. Special defense really makes up. Like, it is good. Okay. Okay, SML reference. But it is cool, okay? I, th I, I just... I think I just want to use it. I mean, I think all these Pokemon look cool to me more than so than others. But well, I know they all look really cool to me. But this sh like this fan art down here, it's just a lot of people use it, and it's just one of those Pokemon. Well, it, I'm this is just me, and I don't really know what it's like for the rest of the Pokemon community. The rest of the Pokemon community could be like, well, Kingdra, I really want it. They have it like on all their teams. I just know I don't usually think of Kingdras, but when I see some, well, not. Well, I think so, but when I see someone else use it, I'm like, whoa, I like that. Maybe I want to use it, but I never actually get around of using it. Because remember that tragic story of me selling all my Pokemon games. But I'm building my collection back. There's a collection back, so. All the Pokemon games now that I want, that I got to fill the Pokemon collection is the original Red and Blue, the original Silver and Gold. And yes, I would probably just get them on the e-store if I get a 3DS again, not on the actual cartridge, because then I probably have to get a Game Boy. And I have the... Oh, uh... Yeah, sorry. Someone was calling. Uh, and then... Uh, he's just another YouTuber. I know I can't really say what to do, but please don't call him back. And then, um... I probably shouldn't post his uh, permission, but... I'm probably gonna do it anyways. No, I'll probably ask for his permission, but, uh... You know, I have to get the original Game Boy, but I have the original, I have Ruby the original, I have Pearl and Platinum, I have White, actually, when I was making my last couple videos, I don't remember which one, I said I was playing Black, but it was actually White, I have White and White 2, so not Blacks, so I thought, for some reason I have Black, it's actually Whites, then I don't have, then, okay, uh, Hang on, sorry guys. But uh I really should have that. I don't know how to, but and then I and then the 3DS games I gotta get are X and Y. I don't have to get it, but I want it. X and Y, the remakes of Hoenn, Sun and Middleton Ultra Moon, then Let's Go's and I don't know. And then Sword and Shield, obviously. So yeah, King Josh is one of the second where I see I wanna be able to use I wanna use it, but I don't really think about it. And so yeah, I wanna use it because it's kinda like one of those Pokemon which is cool and stuff that you don't really see, you know? So I just want to use it for the fact that it's cool and I've never used it before and it shiny looks cool. The stats don't really pop out to me. I mean, they're good stats. They don't pop off to me too much to me. I mainly just want to use it because it's a cool Pokemon. Other people use it. And then another Pokemon I really want to use is Mamoswine. It's a ground ice. Again, another ground bulky. Its stats, or its attack is good. Defense, special attack, special defense. Its speed's pretty good. Defense, special defense is really low, especially its weaknesses being fire and water. 
Well, I don't know if it's neutral because of the ice and ground, but it could be kind of weak to special attackers. But I think it's cool because it's a bulky Pokemon. I believe you ride in it in X and Y in the ice in the snowy areas. It's shiny. I a lot of people I don't do people like shiny green shinies. I don't know, but that's actually supposed to be goggles. I think you know people walking this don't have goggles like their eyes. I think it's cool, but it's like a it's like a cute little nose. It's got horns. You know, me and bulky ground type horn Pokemon. I enjoy them. I I like them. So I just want to use it because it's bulky. Enjoy design. I really like it. Stats are pop out to me pretty good. That attack shiny looks good. I just like the round design of it. I think it's just cool. Again, these Pokemon are probably not going to be in the Wandering or be able to trade in game, which is Papaleo or Populo and Totodog. I don't know how to pronounce Populo or Populo. I want to get them because, again, watch my other videos on why Totodog because of Family Connection. So that freaking alligator, is cool. freaking alligator is cool. And Papaleo, Papaleo. Um, I want to use it in Sun and Moon, but I thought it was girly Pokemon. So I got, I got embarrassed of using it. So I want to use it without being embarrassed, which I wouldn't be now. And then again for my starter, I don't know yet. We got a grass monkey, fire bunny, score bunny, and a tadpole water thing. I don't know. So that is my possible Pokemon team part two. So like and subscribe for the third part. It will be coming up Monday. Don't like and subscribe. I mean, even if you, no one likes this video or subscribes, I'll still post the video. But let me know what you would have possibly on your team. Thank you guys. Like and subscribe. He's always a man child. I have my I have my exactly little pony.